all started with a tweet from that boy Tycino when he says, landed in LA. And that's going to turn the 2K community on his head for the next few weeks. And I'm going to tell you why right after this. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video and comment Tycino down below. That's going to do two things for y'all. Number one, every single Friday, we give away $50 in VC, Cash App, or we give away a copy of a video game of your choice. Uh, we're going to be choosing the winner to on tomorrow. That's number one. Number two on stream. Number one. That's number one. Number two. And this is the more important one. Uh, at the end of the month, if we can average 8K views, man, all y'all got to do is watch the video, like the video, share the video. If we can average 8K views, we're going to be giving away a next-gen console, whether it be an Xbox, a PlayStation, a laptop, or we're going to give away $500, whichever you choose. Number three, and this is the more important one, the bots are in town. Make sure y'all don't talk to the bots, man. What they're trying to do is think y'all make y'all think I'm on Telegram or that I'm on some other medium. I'm on Instagram and Twitter and Black Planet. That's all. I'm not on anything else. I'm not putting my phone number down there for y'all to contact me. And I'm not on Telegram, man. So make sure y'all ignore that. And with all that out of the way, good morning out there in 2K land, man. Hey, like I said, bro, that boy Tycino, he sent the thing, he sent the whole 2K community into a frenzy. And we're gonna be talking about that, man. But before we get that going, we uh, it all it all goes together, man. So make sure y'all just, just rock with me on this right here. Hey, the girl boom time. Bo I mean, Boomy with the logo. She, she just changed her name or whatever. She says, not gonna lie. Based on a lot of y'all, a lot of y'all's tweets, it seems like y'all not gonna, con I mean, not gonna be content until 2K is, a uh, until the game of 2K is dead. Maybe we're the ones that need to reevaluate just some food for thought. And I'm not gonna lie to y'all, man. This right here. This right here. Everything. Maybe we're the ones that need to reevaluate. And uh and and you know what I'm saying? Like, like that's something that I that I really have been saying and I've been saying for the longest, bro. Like, we we are the ones that are killing the game by saying the game is dead. If I came to you every day and said that that uh I pick up dog for a living, and then I said, Well, you know, I mean, why why would you want to watch me do that? So if I keep saying the game is then why would you want to watch me play the game if i keep saying every time i'm talking about it, i'm saying man this game is so bad this game is this this game is that i don't like the game this 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 that and the other people are not gonna watch you because they're gonna get the stigma and eventually and this is something that i had to go through back in the day nobody wants to get on a game that they're enjoying and watch other people complain about the game especially the things that they like in the game so into a to a lot uh, to a very large degree i do feel like the 2k community is doing this to themselves you tweet negatively we talk negatively every time we get on the game this game try every time you lose a game you you scold the community talk about people trying hard doing this that and the third like if I was a person that was a patron of 2K videos, I probably wouldn't want to watch it either. So like she said, just some food for thought, man. But y'all let me know what y'all think. This is something that I want to know. My boy Quavo. Hey, my boy Quavo, Quavo, man. Hey, this boy, hey, one of the, hey, like I said, man, God, that I, I rock with Quavo. He says, bro, current gen is way more lit than next gen. Um, Again, shaking my head. This stuff is crazy. I'm at a loss for words. This 2K stuff. Now, Never being at a loss of words, that boy Quavo Quavo is saying that he believes that next gen is more, I mean, current gen is more lit than next gen. Do y'all think that's the case? And why do y'all think that's the case? I've not seen a lot of 2K content in general blow up, you know, this year, but at the same time, it could be because there's a disconnect in the community and the majority of the community is still on uh, current gen, or maybe it's the majority of the community, because let's just break it down. We know that the most, most people on current gen are probably going to be kids, and the most people that watch 2k on youtube or twitch or anything they're gonna be kids so you know uh maybe that's maybe that is what the correlation is people gonna watch what they have and uh because mostly kids are over there then you know that's who's watching the video so maybe that's what's driving the content maybe we do need to reevaluate that and check that out so i'm with that uh back to tycino man this is what sent the thing to our friends and that boy said wages start tonight at 8 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. This is 11 p.m. Uh, our time. I will be doing a watch party on this. Make sure y'all here on YouTube or Twitch or whatever. Poor Boy Sam versus Tysino. $1,000 pot. NBA 2K23. PS5. 2v2. No delay. No excuses. See you there. And this is what I like. No delay. No excuses. See you there. There, and we got them eyes right there, boy. Look at that. We gonna see you. We gonna see y'all there, man. Beat me, what we used to say back in the day. 
hey, meet me there, beat me there. But we gonna get there and we gonna have a good time, man. And like I said, no delay, no no excuses. I like that. I like the fact that it's no delay, no no excuses. Because anytime we lose in the 2K community, Tassino included, there's plenty of them things now. By that delay is the number one excuse in America. Now I ain't gonna get to you, my boy. But you know, it's a valid excuse. Even though, like I said, Brute Brutusim is near in Brazil and he's hooping and we and we we make it work. But yo. I do understand what you're saying about that. Now, I ain't gonna calculate you. Like, it is, a, 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 hey, we know how it is when you can't move the way that you wanna move, especially when you play the game the way that Tassino plays it. So, hey, I, I totally understand. But I do think it's easier for people from the from the West Coast to play with people from the East Coast. Cause I got some people from the from the West Coast that can't, they say, or in Texas, they say, I can't play on West. I got to play on East. And that's weird, cause uh, Verde, he can play on East no matter what. And that's crazy to me, but you know, it is what it is. Up next, hey, we got that boy, uh, Chrissy T said this dude is a gamer he says look man we are we in hollywood just walking around he says sounds good okay uh i'm gonna uber back he said can't can't do this uh you know can't practice any day uh he says you know we'll uber back in like 15 minutes and then he says uh get you know get your butt home which is grind season he says bro the stuff took way longer i mean this joint Took, look way better in GTA Hollywood me it, bro. I ain't gonna lie, he said he's just a gamer, man. Like he said, though, I feel him, I feel him on that, man. Most cities are gonna look better in, uh, in GTA and all that good stuff, man. And last but not least, this is something that we're gonna talk about. And um, this is a hot button in the 2K community and has been for years. That boy Dime work, he says this right here. I'm not gonna lie, wreck ain't wreck no more. It's pro am now. Now, I know a lot of people gonna take offense to that right there. A lot of people gonna agree with him and all that good stuff. A lot of people, there's a certain part of the community that feels like you shouldn't be able to go and wreck with five, which is literally the most asinine thing I've ever heard in my life because these are the same people that'll go to the park and squad up with three, but you're not in park 333 program, but they tell you if you're playing wreck and you in, and if you got five, just because we got five, they might not even be a five that's even competent or that we've played with together man y'all got five you should go no 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 you should shut the f up shut the f up i'm gonna play where i want to play and you play where you want to play if you ain't trying to get better and we lose all the time in there because hey it is what it is bro that doesn't mean that but for the most part and i, I hate this excuse too and somebody gonna say for the most part if you are in there by yourself you're either gonna get stacked with four people that are already together or you're gonna get stacked with just playing once. I very rarely play squads when I'm by myself. The key is, if you're playing with three, you're normally gonna play randoms or whatever. If you're playing with four, you're probably gonna get squads because they're gonna give you one to complete the squad and you're gonna do that. So yes, you can be a random and play play against the squad, but it's not because the team, it's, it's more because it's, it's still a squad. They just put you with a group of four to complete the squad. But you know, it is what it is. You just ran them on the squad. But hey, that, that boy C six seven said definitely not. But it's not random teams anymore either. I don't think it was ever really random teams though. He says you got you guys think you shouldn't be able to you guys think you shouldn't be able to bring five into into uh wreck because y'all playing by yourself. That's what I'm saying, bro. I mean that's that's y'all. I mean they ain't got nothing to do with it, man. He said it's like why why you trying so hard uh, if you want to be sweaty, go to Pro-Am, LOL. And so this is what the dude said. He said, most five-man lineups in rec would lose 150 to 10 in Pro-Am. And, um, I mean, it would be 150 by the end of the third quarter. And that right there, my G, is a fact. We know if we go in the rec and in the, in the real Pro-Am team, Pro-Am, we're going to get blasted. It's just not going to be funny because we don't have a squad that's equipped to deal with that. We got some players that's equipped to deal with that, but I know I'm not on that level. Brood and Gambit on that level. They got to find three other people that's on. Hezzy probably on that level in Birch, but they still got to find some other people to, to, to fill out the squad. They carrying my trash, and so I know we got to stay in rec. I'm the one that's holding us down. It's me. I'm like it is what it is. I'll admit that right there. They say two three zone, two three zone of hell. Imagine being afraid of a two three zone, which all you gotta do is shoot your way out of in a game where you can create a player that can shoot. It's not my fault that you didn't make a player that can shoot. A two three zone is not effective against us because all you gotta do is shoot your way out of it. Put two people at the hash, one dude at the head, dribble to the right, throw it back to the left, cash, pipe it up. I got them price on reserves. You can't do that, you probably, you know, you need to work on shooting or whatever. Two three zone is not effective in there, especially if they're not swinging and doing what they're supposed to do. It's the swinging and the rotations, it's not just the zone. One person says, 
because LOL, it probably has to do with the fact that you've always gotten more rep and rec. I think if 2K wants to see more Pro-Am players, they need to make Pro-Am more rewarding. Hey, all this right here, all this right here. Bro, if they want more people in there, they need, and, but they don't care if people are in there, so you know it is what it is. Like, this community will make anything sweaty slash not fun. I mean, if you get a little bit better, you're gonna have some fun though, right, my dog? I ain't gonna lie to you. I mean, I ain't, I ain't hating on you. I, I see you cross hezzy, but cross hezzy tween. I know you following me, my G, but uh, you know what I'm saying? I follow you, but uh, yeah, uh, I, 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 you can't, you, they, what they gonna do? They already did everything that the people say. They say, say running with a squad is a must. You dang all right, because if you go in there with bombs, you got bomb wreck is the move. That was one person say. He said, hop in to have fun. Just made my 16th build, uh, and boom, three, two triangle, not even two, three. Now that's a lot better. That's a lot harder to deal with, but I'm gonna tell you something like this, brother. If you may just made a player and you in 92 and under wreck, I seriously doubt that you ran into a squad, bro. Come on, man. Like we, we, we just gonna say anything, bro. If you go into 92 and under wreck by yourself, you're probably gonna be playing by yourself, especially in there. Lockdown, full court pressing, uh, pressing with the cherry on top. It's me. I'm I'm pressing full court with me and brute. 99 steel and we doing that in wreck yeah it's me i'm niggas. i feel it i understand because when i'm in there by myself i feel the same way but guess what when i'm in there by myself i don't expect to win i don't expect to win i have no expectations when i go into random wreck because i know i don't have somebody that can carry it is what it is just like when I go into the theater, I got no expectations. You go in there by yourself, you should have no expectations. Why are you expecting to win? Why do you think that you should be able to win? It is what it is. It's random wreck. Random things are going to happen. I feel you, though. Hey, he says, it's weird people go in with a full five against them. I mean, to go against another full five when there's a literal game mode for that. And like he, like my dog said, man, he said, no one is just going to play five. Uh, play five uh, with their friends and lose 90 to uh, 10 in program and that's a fact Ain't nobody finna go in there with five of their friends and go make a team and we, we, we don't even got no team And then we actually lose they they always in the comment section talking about oh y'all actually going to get some comp now No, it's because we got people on the team that don't understand what we trying to do This is the precisely why we're not in there. It is what it is Y'all just get to see it on stream. They said but people don't people don't run with this. So this is what I'm talking about right here All right, hey, hey t t Tell them my boy all this right here but people don't run with the same five all the time sometimes it's just a buddy and they bring i mean they, they this is just a buddy that they bring in and a few guys from their friends list and that's absolutely correct and like i said bro if you in there and you ain't even really that good at the game you shouldn't be expecting to win anyway when me and boot go in there on play call of duty and we have one good game and they put us against first they put us against uh the, the uh they first they put us against seal team six then the power rangers then uh then all you know uh x-men justice league and then superman prime like when they do that we don't get mad on call of duty we just play the game but we don't expect to win because we know we don't have teammates now if we go in there with teammates and nobody shooting down the uav that's when i have an issue but i feel y'all on that man uh but when i'm in that simple fix no squads wrecked they already gave y'all 92 and under wreck. What else you want? He says, so I can, his dude says, so I can play with trash randoms? Nah, me and my team go in wreck to practice before Pro-Am. If we don't have, uh, if we don't have five, we run wreck till he's on. So nah, that's not a good situation. That's not a good solution. A lot of people suck at 2K, bro. I hate randoms. And that's what the problem is right here. Write it down. Take a picture. If you are always playing against somebody that's better than you and you can never find anybody that sucks and you can never beat on nobody that sucks guess what it's you you suck you need to get better it is what it is if i shouldn't have to sweat to do this in a video game if you don't want to get better at the video game that's fine don't sweat to get better at the video game but don't expect to win either that's it i played i played uh brute and gambit we played the driving simulator i didn't grind as hard as they did guess what every time we went out there and played i got my whoop because I didn't grind as hard as I didn't expect to win. I didn't expect anything because I don't go as hard as they do. So you shouldn't, I mean, these dudes just be better than you. It is what it is. He says, actually, I don't mind because solo queuing and getting teamed up 
with the four stack as a big is smooth and that's exactly what I'm saying sometimes you're going to go in there by yourself and you will play against another team but you're on a team of four and y'all should be able to do something against them it's not their fault that y'all ain't communicate it's just not it says a big a big is always the move when going in solo you have no you have no shot at getting the ball as a guard if you join up with a guard that's a fact right they said dudes going direct with four squads and lose the team of randoms well if that's the case why are we complaining what huh if this right here is the case because somebody just want to say something you understand what i'm saying you just want to say something dudes go in with the full squad and lose the randoms hey if this if that is the case why are we even complaining People in there to try to complete goals and do stuff, bro. You're not completing that goal of getting your uh, getting your passes and your assists and your points and stuff with, with, with randoms. It's just not going to happen that well. He said, literally, bro, I'm tired of going in myself and match up with an actual squad. Shoot, just quit out like y'all been doing and just, uh, you know, but y'all can't. But you can't now, huh? But you can't now because it's going to hurt that it's going to hurt that goat rep. Huh. I don't know, man. Like I said, I feel differently about it. I understand y'all's y'all's pain, but I just don't share it because I know when I go in there and I go in there by myself a lot, I lose. I play raising with randoms, I lose. He said, "Wreck is like uh, this." My <laughs> Joe and DL. Wreck is like the go-to for me and my friends to grind bills. Exactly, exactly what I said. Just to face up against a five stack running five out in two three zone. Hey, it is what it is, man. You grinding the bill, you running the debt. We grind, we, we grinding bills, and me, Gambit, and Brute had three new bills, and we was going against that, and we still found a way to make it work, but we understood that we all had new bills, so there were games that we were probably not gonna win, and guess what? We won all of them. Every single one of them we won as long as we had the right personnel. It wasn't, it, that's, it is what it is. He said, if you go in with a team, you're going to play a team. That's exactly what we say. He said, not every time. Definitely still play a lot of random squads. And I'm going to tell you this right here. Nothing is 100%. The game works the way that the game works. If they queue up in order to keep people engaged, they got to keep people on the game. So, yes, every now and then you will play against a squad. If you have go in by yourself, they have to do that because it's not fair to make squads wait just because they squad it up. That's one thing. Same thing with the other program too. But with that, that is for the most part true. Anyway, man, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. I know that joint controversial and it's the biggest controversy in the 2K community right now. Y'all let me know if y'all think that's fair. If it's not fair, hopefully y'all gonna tell me what y'all think. Like I said, for the most part, I think that a whole lot of this the crying on that will be mitigated if y'all stop having expectations uh when you go in because i'll be looking at people that say that and then i go check their win percentage you ain't winning anyway bro you ain't never really won anyway so what are you worried about but you know that's just me i go in by myself anytime i'm playing solo i don't expect to win so i don't even really get mad but when i'm playing with my squad or a team i expect certain things so you know I'm real. I expect for us to win. And I, you know, it is what it is. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till the next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Guys, speak.